good afternoon. So, oh, the mic's over here. So, today I'm going to just do, we're going to show you how to do a little lighting effect um, using a shot that I was using for another a thing. They have this picture here of this little phone on the ground. We want to look, make it look like this phone is actually at a crime scene specifically where there is a police car somewhere off screen and so we give it this effect at the end like there was a like there was a lighty siren going on somewhere nearby um, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our little clip let's zoom it on in here and then this is the possibly complicated roundabout way I went about doing things I went to shapes and then soikle and I made a soikle and then I went down and I turned the size all the way down and I made the softness all the way up so it looked like that and then I made it blue like a cop and then you have a blue circle and so I took my blue circle and I put it right there and I didn't make it that long because that's stupid I made it four uh, frames long okay so now we have a blue circle. But Steven, I can't even see the phone anymore. Well, stop talking. This is what you do. You're going to take it and go to composite mode, go to overlay. And then, see, not only does it pay make the light so you can see through it, but it also gives it this dark, cool, like it's at night look. So then we're going to zoom out, going to take it, and we're going to make it a whole lot bigger. And then we're going to move it over to the side so it's like the light is not in the center of the screen, but instead, to the side, like there's something off screen. And then we're going to zoom it back up. Oh, like that. We're going to, uh, there. OK, so now we have the light. Uh, but Steven, that doesn't look like anything. Um, so uh, paste it. And then take the light. We're going to go back to controls. What are we going to do? We're going to make it uh, not blue. And then, OK, so now it is red. But that's going to look stupid, because then it's just going to become red, Steven. Well, guess what, crossfade. And so we're going to go to cross dissolve, <laughs> and then I'm going to lower that down a, a wee bit like that. Copy those two little frames, and then you can just paste the bejesus out of them, and then add little uh, cross frames in between. Uh, but Stephen, then we're going to have to render, and that's going to take forever. It'll be awkward. Well, I already did it over here, and so we're going to go over here and see what that looks like when you when you have these cross fades in these frames. It looks like a siren. <laughs> the end. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah.